On Saturday, January 17th, Believe Digi and National Cornerstone Healthcare Services had the privilege of presenting the first powering through event in Southern California, Hemophilia in Entertainment, at the beautiful Solar Studios in Glendale, California. There were interactive entertainment exhibits for young people and a fresh and healthy Mexican-inspired meal was provided for free by Superfood for Super People Catering, a female and minority-owned local business. The centerpiece of the day was an enlightening conversation on hemophilia in entertainment and the media with Joel Stein, writer for Time Magazine, Maddie Van, podcaster and hemomom, Patrick Droney, musician and living with von Willebrand's disease, and Rebecca Berenson, actor and hemomom. You're the first person I've met with a bleeding disorder. Well, I'm happy to have introduced you to the community. I, I basically safe. wanted the same safety as someone with a bleeding disorder as a child. <laughs> Music was a really safe thing for me to do, and it was a good outlet for me to channel. As a musician, it's, it is a constant in the back of my head. I just got off a two-month tour. I'm getting a nosebleed in the bathroom in the hotel room. My buddy Kyle's figuring out what to do. You know, it's like, there's little things, and it happens. I've heard of some people in the community getting bashed or... I would say uh, abused, I guess, on like the Facebook, and they'll find out where they live and just be horrible to them. So about what? Like, they don't like the, what they're talking about. We're small enough. We don't need to be smaller. I wrote a column about nut allergies and how they were kind of bogus and overstated. People in my life and just in the world were furious. Imagine if someone wrote that blood disorders weren't real. And then a lot of them uh, cursed me and said, I hope that you're Son, I think my wife was pregnant, has, uh, is allergic to nuts. And he, well, he is. He's allergic to nuts. Uh, so they <laughs> the won. Curse works. Yeah, it's curses work. Shane had been originally diagnosed with uh, rheumatoid arthritis. So he was being treated with blood thinners and heat. And it was uh, about, it was almost three years of that for Shane. Nobody, nobody ever said, could he have a bleeding disorder? What does awareness really mean? Mm -hmm. How do we remember the lessons from these crises to ensure that the people who suffered the most from it, it wasn't, it wasn't for nothing? We, we learned, we moved forward, and we take that lesson forward. I don't know the answer. I think entertainment actually has something to do with it. I think finding ways to make jokes, I think finding ways to write yeah. songs, finding ways to make movies that take those lessons and put it into an entertaining package that can be easily digested it may be the best way to carry a message forward. Absolutely. <clears throat> Which is something that I have to add that you do very well with Stop the Bleeding because when we first initially were diagnosed, we Googled resources here in Southern California and I came across a comedy web series about... I love that we were a resource in Southern I, well, California. Well, <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> but, but, and then, but look how you have. You've turned out to be just such an amazing... You have an impact on my son, on our family, and it's just been a great experience. And we found it because of the, the humor that you brought to the table while trying to also educate people and bring awareness to the bleeding disorder community. One of the things we're most proud of at Believe Digi is our programming. And adults, industry, parents, and kids in the community were entertained, inspired, and gave great feedback and contributions of their own. Baby, look at the state you're in. I believe it'll but I'll be your weather man. Yeah. There you go. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate you having me. Thank you, Patrick. And to top it all off, we just had a great time. information on Believe Digi programming, 
visit us at believedigi.com or youtube.com forward slash believedigi. For more information on National Cornerstone Healthcare Services or NCHS, visit nc-hs.com.